Mega Millions, Barber World TV. I'm here with my man to do it big with him back in the days before he blew up. Well, Keep his line tight, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Pretty boy Redbone, you know what I mean? With <laughs> <laughs> the waves in his waves in his head. Yeah, we used to make him earn his money in the shop back there when he come in there trying to snap my boy Mike Epps. What's up, Kevin, doing it bro? big. What up, baby? Nothing Talk to Barber World TV. Hey, Barber World TV, man. I'm at the number one barber shop in Harlem, USA. Next time you want your stuff light, tight, and all the way right, come on up here at Levels. I've been coming in here for 20 years, getting my hair cut. My man, L Dog Live, Kazo. A couple other brothers went upstate, they ain't here no more. <laughs> but my hairline was right here, y'all, when I first started coming in here. As you can tell, they have fucked my head up. But I keep coming back, cause people like my fucked up haircuts. Bob Woods. That's them barbers on tour, man. Don't blame that shit on us. When you come here, you get it right. It is. Cause I used to come back from out of town, and be like, damn, who fucked you up? <laughs> Mike. Like you've been downtown again, ain't you? Mike, what, what you doing here in NYC? What you here for? You got a big event? Got the big show coming up at the Garden Saturday. That's right, Madison Square Garden. Man, y'all remember when I was doing bar and grills? <laughs> remember Uptown Comedy Club down the street? Rest in peace, Monteria Ivy. Yep. Tracy Morgan used to be down there with the propeller on his head. Yep. Flex. Flex. A uh, crazy Sam. Yep. Oh, oh wow. man. Uh, you, 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 you and Rudy Rush used to be in the shop going at it. Me and Rudy Rush, me and my man Dre used to go at it. Boop, this legendary right here. Uh, you, barber shop. You think you gonna be in town in October for the New York City Barber Battle Three? I will be here for the New York City Battle Barber Three. Hopefully, my man's will be in the bar Battle Barber. These the coldest barbers on the block. Any barbers think y'all want to get with this? Get your dusty ass clippers out, bitches. <laughs> uh, Mike, what's up next for you, man? Any besides this show this weekend, what's your next movie coming out? Hey, man, check your boy out uh, coming out in the new movie, Sparkle, the 1976 movie Sparkle. I'm playing Satin. I got a perm in my head, and I ain't bullshitting. Uh, who who pl who's playing that brother that um smacked up sister? <laughs> Me. <laughs> I'm snorting cocaine and slapping bitches, doing all kind of shit. In the no, the movie's a good movie. I think everybody's gonna really enjoy it. But um, you know, I'm just glad to God then gave me the strength to still be in the business after all them years. I mean, for real, we still standing around here. Right. We got to give all praise to God. You know what I mean? Thank y'all for coming up here at 125th, getting your hair cut. Yeah. I've been getting my shit faded for a while. <laughs> Just don't put that old man cologne around a nigga's neck. I'll smell that for two weeks. <laughs> you can't get that old. Show him the bottle, Larry. <laughs> Mike, Mike, what's your... What's your got motherfucking... That cologne, woo, shit. Mike, what's your what's your favorite movie that you've done so far? You know, I gotta say, All About the Benjamins was my favorite. You know what I mean? All About the Benjamins was my favorite flick. You know what I'm saying? That was hot too. Yeah, yeah. All About the Benjamins was my favorite flick, and we are doing another Friday, so get ready. Get ready. I like that uh, Roscoe Jenkins joint too. You was funny than motherfucker in that joint, man. Yeah, Roscoe Jenkins, man, they uh, 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 paid me in t-shirts and CDs on that. <laughs> Not paid <me>. barbecue. <laughs> barbecue. <laughs> what, what's your worst movie that you didn't like? The Honeymooners. 
They had me and Cedric the entertainer standing there. I was thinking the same thing. I want you to say it. <laughs> <laughs> you still my nigga. This is the barbershop where we keep it real. <laughs> hey, they had us standing there like Cooney and Coonai. Cooney and Coon Can. All right. Yeah, anything else you want to say to the barbers out there in Barber World TV? Barber World TV, I just want to tell all the barbers out there, man, y'all make people's day. You know what I mean? When you cut people's hair, ain't nothing like a fresh haircut. A lot of people come in the barbershop, they ain't feeling good. Their girl is upset with them. But when they get done, come out of that barbershop, man, y'all barbers keep on making that head, keeping their heads right. You feel me?